how can we embrace tapas in the midst of a global wave of grief during the present time great question how can we embrace tapas in the midst of a global wave of grief during the present times in fact tapas is more essential in tough times than in good times in good times even if you are not performing tapas or when i say tapas in in a very basic uh, way it, it is discipline it is uh, or the literal meaning is austerity or ritual so in tough times you have to it is much more essential so how do we embrace tapas see in simple terms if you are working on your own mind and intellect see it is it is few pointers if you taken carefully and worked upon all problems are internal a few pointers all problems are internal all happiness is also internal so if i have to derive that what what i need to do at the at the physical level you are it tapas involves two aspects tapas is a, in fact one of my most favorite sanskrit word is tapas and i always highlight anyone who is reached a, the previous question a, 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 a state of self sufficiency there's a lot of tapas there to form nothing comes out of tapas so the first aspect is you are avoiding the dissipation of energy that's the first aspect in tapas you avoid dissipation at the at the material level at the physical level at the emotional level intellectual level it is uh, if, when you when you avoid the dissipation of energy you know, in the modern context your stop doing list must be bigger than start doing list your stop doing list must be bigger than your start do- you may write a big list of i want to start doing this start you know if you ask me the first make a list of stop doing li- stop doing list it is uh, maybe you s- a person spends one hour on social media and then one hour on television and i don't know what all you know your stop doing list must be bigger than start doing list it is uh, and and uh, the so identify areas where you are dissipating your energy material level the, the, during the pandemic there was this message floating around they said uh, the message is that people are only buying the essentials and and they say that the world the world is going through an economic recession people are only buying people are buying essentials and the world seems to be going through a recession i mean isn't it a, a sign that a lot of non essentials were purchased according to them the economy is going good because all lot of non essentials are purchased the world they say people are only buying essentials in life and why would they why why are people complaining that it's a recession so if you're able to clip the the dissipation of energy at the mid, at the material level external at the physical level physical level at the emotional level you know, anger jealousy fear all that is a or any kind of a negative emotion is dissipation of energy it dissipate in fact it stalls your time you find a person who is angry it takes time it takes time for them to come out of that negative feeling so all tapas the uh, two aspect number one avoid dissipation of energy at all levels i am repeating it so that we get that clear material level i mean, i'm not saying i'm not talking about being miserly or frugal no, you spend what you have to spend but it is you unnecessary stuff how many watches you need actually how many handbags you need how many shoes i was watching one documentary called dirty money and there's this handbag i'm sure most of you know definitely lyal lulu from france hems there's this birkin handbag which is uh, it could be easily 25000 dollars or maybe more the starting price there's this politician the lady she has not repeated her Birk- birkin handbags in her life and the starting price is like $30000 she has not repeated the handbag and where is she now behind bars i mean almost behind bars it is you can so dissipation of energy 
dissipate at the how many we need when when mahatma after mahatma gandhi's death when his possessions were were uh, accounted for and it didn't cost more than 100 dollars i believe his material possessions was not more than worth more than 100 dollars but you know he used a what do you call a you know, mont blanc pen for a few years and that was sold auctioned for millions of dollars can you imagine he used it for a few years it is uh, can you imagine and but what his possessions were not what was not uh, more than 100 dollars and what is his contribution so dissipation of energy at the material level at the physical level it is uh, that's why you know, breathing carefully is is tapas when you go through negative emotions observe the breathing it it is affected so material level physical emotional see biggest tapas we need to perform is at the emotional level we simply entertain emotions it is without even i mean we are uh, we have allowed our mind to run helter skelter we it is, the tapas we lack at the emotional level is so much i mean if you ask me the material level to an extent we understand physical level to an extent in you know, a because of medicines and other things emotional level 9 out of 10 don't understand the uh, tapas required at the emotional level we, we always say nip it at the bud if you are able to observe a negative emotion and understand what happens if i pursue that negative emotion therefore you you avoid pursuing it you avoid going along with it that is that, then you are performing tapas and one of my favorite statements right is that speak when you are angry you will make the greatest speech you'll ever regret speak when you are angry you will make the greatest speech you'll ever regret one few statements you made next 3 days you have to defend or you have to apologize next 3 days you have to apologize if only at that point of time you you know you withheld you will thank yourself and i didn't make those statements especially between partners i mean i of i get this complaints in an argument you know between partners i shouldn't have got married to you why did i get married to you know unless all this after two days you have to apologize no no you are a major part of my next two days you have to apologize if only you kept quiet at that time i'm not saying bottling up your emotion tapas at the at the mental level at the at the emotional level that is why no? i always say at any point of time your gratitude is far greater in your life it has a check on your negative emotions the, the gr- gratitude see you may you may be very successful entrepreneur you may have a master a lot of wealth but when you come back home no, my kids and all are very they are disciplined my parents are well taken care of the credit goes to my wife my partner you know that gratitude is there you know, you, where is a question of you know you having a upper hand in your home it cannot happen because of the gratitude I mean, the number of days i travel and sometimes i don't even know what's happening in the school the so well it is taken care even my parents i mean you know, she knows what medicine is required or what alterations are required in their thing than me that gratitude is higher than your contribution i'm telling you, you know, that's that is tapas that is why they say gratitude is a mother of all virtues it is, it is uh, so the you are avoiding dissipation of negative energies and uh, as a result you are able to bring in the positive aspects to your emotions so that's why i'm trying to say emotional level intellectual level tapas is you don't give in to others emotion others uh, opinions in off late i find you know somebody's opinion of another person you take it on face value and you drop a relationship intellectual level you know, the tapas is you know you exercise your own understanding it's incredible how opinions spoil relationships tapas we are going to take up that sloka where you know i am the knowledge of self of all the knowledge says krishna 
tapas at the intellectual level is you expand your intellect you expand your intellect it is really, there's a there's a contemplation now you don't go by opinions you don't go by others uh, their statements so you go by facts that's the reason you keep working on yourself so tapas at the material level at the physical level it is the conserving the energy see tapas at the physical level you have to ask venu ji venu ji is 65 now sorry 60 60 he, he will not open and unmute himself tapas you have to ask him at the physical level it is uh, i mean because i know him well i'm talking about it i am not aware of others that much regularly goes for a walk I mean walking eating healthy regularly it is not once in a way even though his wife is a great cook it is tapas at the at the physical level. emotional level emotional see emotion you refuse to entertain anything negative about others that's tapas at the emotional level see this statement right and happy and blessed are when wickedness stands forth revealed as goodness bereft of a guide happy and blessed are h o u r r or is when wickedness stands forth revealed as goodness without a guide if that's your quality of emotions you can never get you can never entertain negative emotions intellectual and keep gaining knowledge we we completed the the bhajago in the bhagavad gita kinchit atita little knowledge little knowledge you taken reflect on it it will dispel a little bit of your ignorance little light you taken it dispels a little bit of your darkness and you do it consistently tapas for the greatest tapas is when you are able to be consistent in your approach in yesterday i was meeting a person i was mentioning how uh, you know the temporary how do you, you have to make the temporary high permanent you are attending lectures the temporary high you got to make it permanent therefore you are then you are like a uh, usain bolt three olympic uh, tournaments and uh, all three olympics he gets 100 meters uh, gold it, it is not that one olympic in the first he had it and then next week no no sign of usain bolt three olympics consecutive olympics he got the goal for 100 meters and what's the what's the uh, the uh, uh, the different between the first and the second less than a second you know the gold and the silver what is the dif- what is the difference what make less than a second what amount of tapas must have gone in? so in fact see okay, to conclude tapas should be pleasurable initially it is a bit of a difficulty but it should become a pleasurable it should become a way of life it should become a way of life it is uh, therefore follow a schedule you know in certain ways i it, the best part with the ashram life is there's a schedule when you follow a schedule it brings uh, a system to your life there's a tapas that is why it's like every friday 6 pm is the gita lecture if it be if it if it becomes a schedule in you you're following tapas it's not that in you know, a being uh, what you call uh, you know adamant but in a schedule you follow it becomes a tapas and then that creates a consistency so think about it never miss out on your tapas any worldly achievement is due to tapas and spiritual evolution is self sufficiency is due to great tapas so let's not miss out and if you have missed out on life it is due to a lack of tapas so there's nothing more grand grander grand grand in life than a life of tapas and i'm telling you you'll be so thankful you went through that grind it is tapas because your mother went through tapas you are here if she said i don't think i need that 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 chapter you will not be here. tapas that nine months of tapas pain there is so much they go through it's tapas so if i am speaking here it's almost like 25 years of tapas 
and i tell you the 25 years has been such a glorious journey glorious journey it's a one word we should sum up our life tapas and uh, and if you it's a life if your life is a life of tapas it's a different life altogether see i always say the last day of your life you are answerable to the person who is standing in front of the mirror which is yourself in case that day comes whenever that last day you are standing in front of a mirror and you are you are there's no one else you need to be answerable responsible except yourself and at that point of time when if there is a certain level of fulfillment satisfaction contentment it is because of the tapas you have gone through and if you have not done that and there is a lot of disappointment regret sadness it means you have not performed tapas in the way you have to do it so i mean it's not that and whenever it happens it, it almost you, are, you take a salute that was a that was a grand life i that was a beautiful life was beautiful and you know, you, ex, you exit with such grace and grandeur it is due to tapas it is due to tapas you have made you may could have made wrong choices but you corrected it with a better choice our life is a cycle of choice consequence next choice It's choice consequence next choice so if the next choice next choice is better better you are it is a life of tapas my favorite word and so is nadine very favorite the, her kind of a dedication and her interest in spiritual path is phenomenal she could be of another faith but she is more uh, indian than many indians so continue the continue with your tapas with shraddha two words tapas and shraddha tapas is that discipline is it it's the literal translation of tapas an intelligent utilization of resources at the material physical emotional intellectual aspects of your personality and conserving those energies avoiding the dissipation of energies conserving those energies and directing for a higher purpose that is tapas i repeat tapas is a intelligent utilization of resources at the material level physical level emotional level intellectual level <clears throat> you conserve the energies which could be dissipated you conserve them and direct those energies for a higher purpose then you are living a life of tapas anyone having great physical health tapas great mental health those who had phenomenal mental health during the pandemic times or covid times you have done your tapas it worked well in fact in modern context i say tapas is the insurance premium you pay for in, for something which may have in case it happens now you can't buy an insurance premium when your house is under fire quickly give me one insurance when uh, i will pay the premium whatever right now you know it, uh, why you know, the fire the house is on fire no. you have been you have been diligently paying it in case something happens you're quiet understand things happen so that's it